Army Air Force's Lieutenant Colonel Louis E. Kurtz got a piece of every original signatory to the Axis Pact. In other words, he had kills against Germany, Italy, and Japan. Those mission marks were painted right there on his aircraft. But it's that American flag kill mark on his fuselage that earned him a place in military history, and maybe even the Distinguished Service Cross. It's not a mistake. He actually shot down an American plane, and it was one of the most heroic acts of his career. The young 20-something pilot earned every single one of his kill marks. He joined the Army Air Corps in 1942 at the age of 22 to fly planes against the Nazis. By 1943, he was a hotshot lieutenant and P-38 Lightning pilot with three kills against Nazi ME-109s, the workhorse of the German Luftwaffe. That was 10 days into his first assignment. Within the next month, he notched up two more kills, earning the fighter ace status. In August of that year, he ran into an Italian C-202 and shot it down. Unfortunately, that was his last combat kill over Europe. Kurds was shot down by Nazi pilots over Italy and captured by the Italians, resigning himself to spending the rest of the war in a POW camp. That did not happen. Italy capitulated a few days into Kurd's internment. Kurds was then sent to the Philippines and put behind the stick of the new P-51 Mustang fighter, going up against talented Japanese pilots. He was quickly able to shoot down a Japanese recon plane near the island of Formosa. His Axis hat trick was complete, but that's not where the story ends. He and his plane, Bad Angel, were fighting over Japanese-held baton when his wingman was shot down over the Pacific. Soon after, he saw a C-47 transport plane wheels down, headed to land on the Japanese island. When he was unable to make radio contact, he tried to physically wave the transport off, but came up empty. So, rather than allow the American plane and its crew to be held prisoner by the Japanese, he used the only option left. He shot them down over the ocean. Kurd skillfully took out one engine and then the other without blowing the entire cargo plane to bits. He was able to bring the C-47 down just yards from his downed wingman. Kurds returned to the site the next morning as an escort to an American flying boat. The pilot, crew, and passengers were completely intact. And among them was a nurse Kurds had dated just the night before, a girl named Valerie, whom he later married. That's right, one of the passengers on the plane he shot down actually became his wife. And that's what people did before Tinder. The story was later told in a book titled U.S. Army Air Force Pilot Shoots Down Wife. Legend has it he was awarded the Distinguished Service Cross for downing the unarmed cargo plane, but his citation was so ordered for actions while in the European theater. Who knows? Either way, it makes a great story. And he still wins the best How I Met Your Mother story of all time. What are your favorite World War II stories? Leave a comment below and maybe we'll make a video about it next.